a family gathering coming up soon, maybe a major milestone that you'd like to play some photos in a slideshow. Or maybe you're just at home and you'd enjoy seeing your pictures in a slideshow on your computer screen when you're not using it. Isn't it wonderful to look at your old family memories? Like, I enjoy looking at them because I forget so many of the things I've done in life and it brings back such good feelings for the most part. We're going to talk about a really simple way for you to watch a slideshow on your computer. Hi, I'm Molly Bartelt, a photo estate planner with Pixology. We are your go-to experts in evaluating photo saving apps, tools, software, anything that can help you save a memory, we probably have an opinion on. We also provide motivation because your photo collection, working with it is like a lifelong journey. You keep making memories, you keep taking pictures, and you've got to do something to save the good ones and enjoy them. A photo slideshow is a perfect example of how you can enjoy some of your old family memories. Now, at my company, Pixology, which we're in Milwaukee, we usually recommend that people organize their photos, whether they're printed pictures or they're digital pictures. It makes making a slideshow a little easier, but sometimes you don't have time for that. You've got a collection of photos and you just want to play a slideshow. All right, turn on your Mac and let's go to the Photos app. I'm in my Photos app and in the left-hand column is the navigation panel and I've clicked on My Albums. I have organized my pictures by decades and years and topics and I'm going to select this trip to Maryland last summer. Hold the control key down and click on the album and select Play Slideshow. The Photos app gives you themes that you can choose from. So we've got sliding panels there. I could do classic, which I bet is pretty boring. Origami is kind of fun. And if you wanted, you can change the music to something from your iTunes library. Once you're happy with the theme, just select Play Slideshow. and watch your memories unfold in front of you. When you're done, you can hit the escape key and you'll be brought back to the view you were in. Now, if you wanna make a slideshow that you can export, you're gonna scroll down on that navigation pane down to my projects and click the plus sign. There you can select slideshow with the Photos app, and since I had that album selected already, it's going to take those 143 pictures and put it into the new slideshow. And for now, I'll just leave the slideshow name as uh, The Trip to Maryland and click OK. Here, I can add titles and move the pictures around if I wanted. When I'm done with the slideshow, I click Export, and then I save it to my desktop, copy it to a USB drive and take it with me where I want to go and play the slideshow, whether it's at my mom's house or someone else's. It's so much fun to save these slideshows. So that's using the Photos app on your Mac to watch a slideshow and to make a slideshow. Photos can make you laugh and cry and, and so much more. It's so much fun when you're walking through the house and you see a photo slideshow playing on your computer or maybe on another device even. It really warms the heart and if you do have people over, they will enjoy seeing the memories too. That is just one way to watch a slideshow of your family photos. Do you create slideshows? Leave a comment below. We'd love to hear what you do and it might help someone else. Making a photo slideshow is just one part of the journey we have with working on our family photo collection. If you need help with this, we definitely have links below 
going to talk about how to organize and preserve family photos. I have a book on Amazon and we have other videos that might help you in your process of saving family memories and your family legacy. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and that's it for now. We will see you the next time. Mm -hmm.